the world population is 80 billion people. About half of those are women. So it's 4 billion women across the globe. Let's say that they are of approximately equal age distribution from the age of 0 to 100. So if we want to take the amount of women who are between the ages of 20 to 30, it's approximately 10%. So 10% out of 4 billion is 400 million women between the ages of 20 to 30 across the globe. Let's say that only 1% of them are beautiful. So it's 4 million beautiful women between the ages of 20 to 30 around the globe. I took the ages of 20 to 30 because uh, uh, beneath the age of 20 is uh, a bit young, although if it's over 18 it could be passable. Um, but above the age of 30 it begins to be not as desirable. So I took the simple rule range of the age of 20 to 30. And I didn't take race into account because it's true that I am attracted to white girls. While I am attracted to white girls, I would rather date a good-looking black or Asian girl rather than an ugly white girl. So race is not, is not the primarily deciding factor. And besides, I would rather enjoy the company of good-looking girls or appreciate them otherwise, regardless of race, rather than exclude one or more races from the table. So, I'm not being... I'm not taking race into account at all. It's 4 million beautiful girls between the ages of 20 to 30 around the globe. Now, let's say that we want to be even more restrictive. <coughs> we want to pick a very specially selected group out of those women that are the most beautiful out of them and also very well mannered and per perhaps educated also the very best out of those four million beautiful girls so we take one percent of this group who are the very best one so percent out of 4 million is 40,000 beautiful and also highly selected girls around the globe. 40,000 beautiful and highly selected girls around the globe. I think that it's a very good number. I think that it's more than enough of girls to have and to appreciate and to enjoy. And the good thing about it is also that every 10 years we'll get 40,000 new girls who are beautiful and highly selected. So it's, re it's great really if you think for whomever, whoever enjoys the company of women or uh, enjoys women anyhow it's really it's really great to know that that there are 40,000 of super highly selected women 
and in 10 years there will be another 40,000 and in 10 years after that there will be another 40,000. We'll never run out of them and there will always be plenty. We don't always know where they are located or what they are doing, but that is beside the point. The point is that they are there. That's the point, that they are there. They are on the same planet. They are not in some faraway galaxy. They are they're like uh, around the neighborhood. They are there. It's, it's, not, uh, it's not like they are out of reach or something. And we'll always have them. And it's really great. Now, there, there is something that's not very great that happened to me, unfortunately. But for the past 18 months, I have been tortured for the sake of the Emma Watson group with the with the justification that they are supposedly some sort of queens and they, that, that it's the only woman in the world and I'm supposed to live for their sake. And I find it absolutely disgusting. And it's completely... Not only that it's untrue and it's, it's a disgusting thing to, to try and tell me, the numbers that I've just shown that are common sense and easy to calculate for whomever that has the awareness, they show that the Emma Watson group, that they are trash, that nobody needs them. Do you know why? Because while they can be easily replaced by someone else, by countless of someone else, by thousands and thousands of other women, they can be replaced very easily. They try to make of themselves some sort of queens that would go as far as attack as a person's body, a person's body, if he doesn't, if he doesn't bow before them, if he doesn't, if he doesn't regard them as some sort of a stupid queen, which they are not. So this proves that they are trash. Who the fuck wants a bitch that has, su that has some sort of shady organization behind her that would go and attack your body to try and make you her slave? Who the fuck would want such a stupid bitch in their life? Such a useless, evil bitch that brings nothing but pain and suffering. When you could easily have 40,000 super highly selected women around the globe every 10 years. Who the fuck would want a bitch like that? The stuff that I'm talking to you is just common sense for whomever that has the awareness. I'm just angry that those stupid bitches are pushed onto me when they are nothing but trash, trash that they can so easily replace and that they, that they just not, don't know their place when they should, we should, they should know it. They should know their place, that they are trash. They are trash that goes as far as attacking another person's body to try and push their ego over other people. Who the fuck do they think they are? They will be punished for everything that they have done to me. They will answer for their crimes. And I will enjoy the company of 40,000 highly selected women around the globe every 10 years. <laughs>